Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Let's talk about Boba Fett again. Um, this is Boba Fett, and this is the Return of the Jedi one. You know they got one coming out on card, and what they did was they touched up the yellow on this jetpack and then put them on a card. And he's still going to carry like the deluxe figure pricing or basically just the more expensive pricing. But here's one of the things that... I know I've talked about this before, but you see like the uh, this piece right here. This is a sleeve that goes over a body and you can see it in there and you can see how it's kind of just on top of the body. And on the older Boba Fett, this piece was just the body. It was all molded on there. And one of the things that they did was they created that smartly in a way because they knew they were gonna be coming out with a whole bunch of Mandalorian figures. Here is Cobb Vanth and you can see he's got an orange body underneath with just that sleeve on there. And then, of course, you got that throne room Boba Fett, and he has that same sleeve on there. And these look really cool, and this is like the lower legs. Now, they did come out with this figure, and this guy's got his robe on, and, um, you know, this is what the legs look like on that one. And uh, what I wanted to do in this video, and why I didn't really show that off, is because they have an exclusive... Um, they have an exclusive Walmart one that's coming out. And it's basically the Boba Fett when he first gets his armor. And he's dressed like this before. And then he grabs his armor. Now that one's on back order. And it's not going to come out until January, I think, is what I saw. But basically because of that sleeve, what I did was I took one of these Tython Boba Fetts with the body like that. And I just took the Return of the Jedi sleeve and arms and I just swapped it out with that head and the helmet removed and basically I got this upper body now with all the bullet packs and stuff like that just like that one that's going to be the Walmart exclusive and if I wanted to I could just take some dark paint some brown paint and go in there and touch this up but I just wanted to kind of do it proof of concept and then this is the Return of the Jedi I just stuck that sleeve on the body and stuck the arms and this, of course, is a 3D print of my head one that I did. But um, basically, it, it really is just a sleeve. And I didn't cut it or anything like that. I just heated up the arms with like a blow dryer from underneath. It's pretty warm. You see how pliable that becomes? Then you basically just grab it and just pop it and it comes right out. And you can easily reseat this piece here just by pushing it back in because it's super pliable and you wanna repeat that on both sides. Once you have this whole thing heated up and I heated this up separately, you can see how pliable that becomes and then it just pulls right off. And, and that's what that piece looks like uh, with the uh, body off the sleeve. So the body's pretty plain underneath and the sleeve really just adds it and that's it right there. But basically what I wanted to do was I just wanted to show how you could take that Tython Boba Fett and a Return of the Jedi Boba Fett, which I think you can get pretty reasonably right now on uh, Amazon, and then just kind of take that sleeve off and customize your own. Now I thought about leaving the arms on, but then I would lose these pieces here because um, that doesn't allow for the inner swapping. I could also just change it down at the elbows then I would have less painting to do. The only other problem is that you can see through the sleeve in the body, that Tython body doesn't actually have a hole for the jetpack, so I would have to drill one in there. But anyways, um, that's kind of my proof of concept for just swapping around the armor onto different figures and to see how that would like look. And I think it turned out okay. I mean, even though I do have to do probably some paint work and stuff like that, I think that's a pretty good uh, way to go if you don't want to wait and you want to get that look. Anyways, everybody, I, thanks for tuning in. I really appreciate it. And don't forget, have a fantastic day.